Hey, what is up everybody? My name's Star Lords. I hope that you're having a fantastic day. And in today's video, we're actually going to be t counting down the top 5 Marvel characters that I would like to see in Fortnite Battle Royale Season 4 Battle Pass. For those of you who don't actually know, the next Battle Pass is somewhat going to be superhero themed, which means that we will see some superhero looking characters in the Battle Pass itself. Now, I know for a fact that Epic Games do not own any of the properties to Marvel, uh, but b this video is basically calling out my top 5 Marvel characters that I would like to see skins based off in Fortnite Battle Royale. Because of course, you know, they would have got sued for using the John Wick, but instead they changed it about a little bit, you know? So, they can do that again with existing characters already in, you know, Marvel or DC. Uh, but like I said, today's video is going to be counting down the top 5 Marvel characters that I would like to see in Fortnite Battle Royale. Now before we do get into the video guys, please do not forget to leave a like and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already for more Fortnite glitches, guides, videos, all of that kind of stuff, including my Season 4 Battle Pass giveaway. I'm actually going to be buying 5 people a Battle Pass because I know some people can't really afford it or you know, they just haven't got the money at that time to buy it. So if that's something that you feel interested in, subscribe, turn on notifications and I will have an update video on that in a couple of days. Yeah, but anyway, now that that's over and done with, let's get into the top 5 Marvel characters that I would love to see added to Fortnite Battle Royale. Now we're going to start off with one of my favourite superheroes ever, and uh, this is going to be Iron Man. Now Iron Man is a really cool character, unfortunately he doesn't actually have abilities like every other superhero, he's more like the Batman of Marvel, you know, because he basically has money and he's a really cool character, I mean, to be honest, when I put Mar- like when I put- Batman and Iron Man together, you know, they're two very similar characters, but when I look at their suits, I've got to admit guys, I'm sorry, but the Iron Man suits are so much better than the Batman suits that I've seen. I mean, what you're probably going to see on screen right now is actually the Iron Man suit that is from the Superior Iron Man comic book line, and this Iron Man suit in particular actually allows you to go up into space and, uh, yeah, kind of in the cosmos, you know? Because some suits don't actually allow him to withhold the boundaries of space, and fortunately for him, he has a lot of knowledge, and the Superior Iron Man suit is the suit that he uses when he becomes a Cosmic Avenger, you know? So this suit in particular is really awesome, and personally the reason why I'd just like to see an Iron Man suit in the game is because the Iron Man suits are so good, and there can be so many different kind of variants to them, and I would love to see Fortnite's take on what an Iron Man suit would look like in their little universe, you know? So yeah, that is why I picked Iron Man as my number one superhero that I would love to see based in Fortnite Battle Royale. Now we're going to move on to another character and this is actually going to be a villain. It's not actually going to necessarily always going to be, you know, uh, the heroes or, you know, what anything like that. But this is actually a villain by the name of Red Skull and he is on screen right now. And as you can see, he, if I saw that guy running up to me with a pump shotgun, I would shit my pants. I'm telling you right now, he looks scary as Book, I'm telling you, but uh, Red Skull looks amazing, especially this variant right here with the armor and, you know, the Red Skull and everything. It just looks very menacing and it v looks very villainy, you know? He definitely is a villain, not to be messed with. And to be honest, I never really used to like Red Skull that much because I've never read any of the comics with him. And the first Captain America movie actually featured him. And honestly, I was like, well, okay, he's pretty cool, but that is pretty much it, to be honest. But... I've kind of got into Red Skull a little bit, the whole look of him just looks menacing to be honest, and he looks scary, you know, so I really would like to see a villain kind of character added into this battle pass, because you know, who, if the, vi if the heroes have no villains to battle, like, how are they superheroes, you know what I mean? Like, they have to have villains to actually battle, and if we don't have villains in the battle pass, I'll be kind of disappointed to be honest. So, Red Skull, or somebody that kind of looks a little bit like Red Skull would be really awesome in the battle pass, I would just think it'd be really cool. Uh, moving on to our next character is a very, very basic one, I know a lot of people will say this, but Captain America. Now, Captain America isn't my favorite Avenger. I prefer Iron Man over Captain America, to be honest. But I do love Captain America, you know? I mean, if, if he died or something like that in the, in the movies, I would be torn apart. I would be so, so sad. Uh, but basically, Captain America is pretty awesome. And not because of the whole character himself. He looks like a very basic character, to be honest. But because... If they actually had a character with a shield, they would use that shield as back bling. And honestly, walking into a game with a Captain America looking type person with the shield on the back of them, 
that would get me like so happy like that is insane i would think that'd be really really cool imagine like just having the back bling of captain america shield on your back as you're playing the game i don't know i thought it'd be really cool and personally he would be one of those characters that i would only buy if just to get the back bling you know you know the way you buy like the tomato town guy just for the back bling or you know the way you buy um who else let's see you buy the love ranger for the back bling you know that would be one of the characters that i buy just for the back bling so captain america is definitely a third character that i would love to see somehow implemented into the season four battle pass um and as i move on to the next one i just want to say guys comment down below if you agree with me i mean obviously not everybody's going to agree with my choices these are mine and mine own but um yeah if you have your own top five leave them in the comment section below i would actually really like to know how many people know their marvel characters like me um but anyway let's move on to the number four character that i would love to see added to the game and uh, that is ultron now ultron in the comics is really cool he is really menacing unfortunately ultron in the movies was really bad and i really didn't like him but the people like the the ultron in the comics is really cool and looking at the character on screen just a second ago i mean how would you not like to see some sort of robotic kind of menacing kind of person in the game like that i mean looking at that character is really scary and especially like if they made like kind of you know the way you get like your character to move and run and everything and you hear the audio from them? What if you had a robotic kind of character and it made like these robotic kind of moving noises, you know? Like a uh, kind of like a uh, chambers kind of moving and everything inside the body so that they can actually walk and everything. I think that would be really cool to be honest and I don't know. I would love to see Fortnite's take on Ultron personally. I don't know. I just think it'd be like a really cool character to actually add into the game. Especially like a villain character, you know? Because... Ultron in the comics is actually a really good villain. I mean, I really, really enjoyed the storyline with the Ultrons in and everything like that, where basically, you know, Age of Ultron, the whole world was destroyed. Wolverine had to go back in time to kill Hank Pym and everything. It was just really cool. And I don't know, Ultron from the comics is one of my favorite villains. I'll, I'll be honest with you right now. Not a lot of people really like that storyline, but me personally, I really, really did. So uh, yeah, that's someone I would definitely love to add in to Fortnite in some kind of way, you know? They've got to be a villain that is somehow robotic or something, you know? Some kind of like metal kind of villain in the actual battle pass. That'd be really, really cool. Now, last but not least, we have a brand new character that is coming to the Marvel Cinematic Universe and she's been teased for a while now. I know it isn't Black Widow or anything, she's been in it for years, but basically this is Captain Marvel and Captain Marvel is a really cool character. Basically, she's like Captain America, to be honest. She fights for what is right and she's actually half, I believe she, she's half scroll, I guess? She's like half alien and half human and she has some amazing powers in the MCU and in the comic book. She is probably one of the craziest superheroes uh, or, you know, one of those, like, she's just really crazy, to be honest, and her powers are awesome, and she knows what's right, and I just really like this character, to be honest, and the fact that this is coming, like, she is coming to Fort, uh, <laughs> she is coming to the Marvel Cinematic Universe, that makes me really happy, because, like, I just want to see what they do with her on screen, and personally, looking at her costume and everything, it looks really cool, I just like the blue and kind of red kind of combo and everything, I think that's really cool, um, personally, I don't like one of the versions of Captain Marvel. I know there's a Carol Danvers one, and I really like that version, but there's also another version where she has a kind of mohawk kind of thing, and I really don't like that one personally, but um, yeah, I would love to see one of the female skins in Fortnite have some kind of skin that resembles Captain Marvel, and especially if they could have some kind of back bling. Now, I don't know necessarily if Captain Marvel has back bling. I don't, does she have like a cape? I don't think so, but anyway, I would love to see some kind of back bling that goes with Captain Marvel. Now, when I'm thinking about, like, you know, uh, Iron Man and Red Skull and Ultron and everything like that, like, I can't really think of back blings for them, to be honest. I mean, Captain America is the only one that really calls out to me that has an actual back bling that would really suit the game, but I don't know what Iron Man can have, to be honest. Like, I genuinely, genuinely don't know. I mean, if we were talking about the Iron Spider, which is, like, um... Spider-Man but a suit developed by Tony Stark, you know, the back bling that he would have would be like those spider claws that come out, you know, like they would be really cool for that skin, but as of right now, I don't know what would suit an Iron Man or Red Skull or Ultron skin, to be honest. Now, if you guys have any idea what would go good with them as in terms of like back bling, 
comment down below because I genuinely can't think of any right now. Uh, but anyway, that has pretty much concluded my top five Marvel characters that I would like to see somehow nodded at in Fortnite Battle Royale's new Season 4 Battle Pass. I mean, like I said, guys, you're not all going to agree with me. Some of you guys will disagree. And feel free in the comment section below, you know? I mean, I don't care if you guys have different opinions. I would love to see who you would like to add in, in uh, you know, out of the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Uh, but tomorrow or later on today, I've actually got a DC variant of this uh, video coming out. If you do not want to miss out on that, check out on the channel later on today. And, uh, yeah, I'm sure you guys will not be disappointed. Uh, but anyway, guys, thank you very much much for watching today's video have an awesome day enjoy the brand new season four when it comes out and until next time i've been star lord oh see you